Good morning, everyone. Or oh, actually, it's good more morning, like good everyone. noon. Good morning, guys. <laughs> Oh, that was so cute. So we're just about to head down to the markets. They have these like Sunday markets on. So I thought I'd take you guys along with me. It's a beautiful day today. Crystal clear blue skies. What more could you want? Mmm. Mmm. Such a beautiful day. I actually really love this apartment in a sense that like the lighting is just so good. Like there's windows across all the walls. And this view in the, in the afternoon has the most stunning sunset. Yeah, it does the sun sets over here. It's so beautiful. Like, I'm gonna, I'll show you guys tonight. It's such a lovely sunset. If it, hopefully, we'll be able to see it. it doesn't get too like cloudy. <laughs> Did you hear that slow from away? It's doing that on purpose. Why? <laughs> Why? It's gonna be your mouth moving. And just. <laughs> if you couldn't hear what I was saying, oh god, that made me cough. <laughs> Although I'm proud of you, you got your reusable cup. That's really good. I need to get one of those. Oh, by the way, there's this Biome store that I want to check out while we're here. So it's like a environmentally friendly package store, but you can get like reusable things there. So I do want to check that out. But we're going to go down to the markets now. I'll stop rambling on if I can find my thongs. I don't know where I put my thongs, so I have to have a little look. I have the bacteria from your mouth when you slosh oil around. What is it? Oil pulling, pulling toothpaste. No, it's like oil pulling. If you like, you slosh oil in your mouth. I'll tell you how to make it, and you'll never go to the dentist again. Because it it's chemical free, it alkalizes your mouth. And as you get older, you know nothing special wrong in the tooth. Yeah. Your gums shrink. You get all this sensitivity. But what it'll do, it'll whiten your teeth. It'll okay. fit, keep your gums. What it is. It's half coconut oil, yep. the Vedic used sesame, and the other half's organic bicarb from the health food shop, the nice soft cheap. Yeah. Bicarb's alkaline, whitens your teeth. Then in that you must put salt, a bit of Celtic or pink Himalayan. And then I put a couple of drops of calendula, you don't need that. A couple of drops of tea tree, you don't need it, smell it, you can recognize that. It smells so it smells good. Smells so good. Don't make your mouth smell nice because too. Because the best oil, like you get onto Google and I use this and I have no. The best oil that they use in, in Eastern Europe is, is um, peppermint oil. But I reckon after organic food, this is one of the best health things going. Yeah. If you have it in your mouth for long enough, it'll suck toxins up sublingually out of your mucous membranes and you actually absorb nutrients and, uh, for, out of the salt. So mm. what the go is, is to, in a wetted mouth, I think, now normally people just put oil in there and just swish around, yeah. but what I do, see it's a bit of it, it's melted today in the heat and yeah. it goes hard enough, I will put this much on my toothbrush, yep. smear it round, don't clean, smear it round just for 30 seconds and then with your saliva and the bit of wet start, like I did it for an hour here this morning driving, I'd wait for five minutes, drive another 10 and in the end you got <laughs> Yeah. But the thing is, it's full of dead bacteria, totally alkalizes your mouth, cleans, fixes amazing. your gums, white. oh amazing. You have really good quality oil too. Yeah, yeah, well I, yeah, it smells organic. so good here too. Everything smells so nice, like those soaps and things. What ages you is, we're washing the oils out of our skin all the time and we're not replacing it internally with, well, you're going to catch wild salmon and grind flaxseed every day, we don't do it. So over the years, the oils are not there as a protection of barrier and the sun and the elements age your skin. So the thing is, putting oils on externally is good, but it's not as good as having it. Or internal is always the best. It's the same with the CBD cannabis oil. Do you have this daily as well? Yeah. Oh yeah, I microdose a THC and a CBD. I don't get high, but the two together. See, THC kills cancer. That's why they won't legalise it. Chemo's out the door. If you could grow it, and then CBD creates homeostasis, and there's still 112 others that do incredible benefits. And then there's 512 molecules in the plant, not to mention making clothes and bricks and fuel. So what do you do? Like, how do you take them? All right, well, under your tongue, some lignolene six or eight drops under your tongue. Within a 30 seconds, it's got into the mucous membranes, but you don't go and clean your teeth in half an hour and spit it out. It takes about half an hour to get absorbed, and it's into your system. But people that have got major health issues like prostate cancer or gynecological, they're using suppository methods, and one of the best is through the navel. 70,000 nerve endings there. Is that you were attached to your mother, all nutrient you got through the navel, your, your supercomputer brain knew where to send it. It's the same now. You put oil through there. She's okay. so interesting. Thank you, Thank so, you so much. much. See, See you later. later.
How great is that? Oh my gosh. That's why it's called oil pulling. It pulls out the toxins and then so you spit it out. So it pulls out the bacteria, pulls out it all those toxins takes in your, your mouth. Body. Yeah, and you spit it out later. So if you guys are interested in what that guy was talking about, make sure you Google this. Um, how do you even say it? Enjo Nakambinoid. I can't remember. It's just <laughs> how it's spelt, really. <laughs> how do you say it? Endocannabinoids, I think. Endocannabinoids. I think so. Oh, the cakes. Oh, they're free company. What the flavors are the flavors are the cake? What sort of flavors are the cake? So you have a mango, Yum. blueberry, and raspberry. You have the tester, yeah? the same base. Oh. And after, yeah, just they are so yeah. good. Yes. These are the coolest markets, I swear. And we're on the hunt for these donuts that I'm vegan and gluten free. Are these the donuts? Oh my God! Yes, please. We have found them. Hi. Hi. Are these the vegan um gluten free? Yep. Oh, yes! Oh, are those cinnamon? Uh, no, that's that's the chocolate one. That's well, we do have cinnamon today. But these are the varieties we have today. Um. Yeah. So can I get one cinnamon? Um. One of the chocolate. One ones? chocolate. And then the, the that so, one piece. Uh, lemon. And yes, yeah, please. one lemon. Thanks. Yum. Oh my god, guys! I actually like actually have proper. Like a donut. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. That's how you feel I haven't inside. had one in like, I haven't had a proper like cinnamon donut in a solid like, I'd say seven years. Yeah, and it actually like looks like an actual donut. Like look at this beautifulness. It's actually like a proper donut. Oh, it's so good. And it's like crispy. It's everything I remember in a donut. My life is complete. This girl singing is actually incredible. I was sun baking before by the pool. I could hear her, she's amazing. And it's only behind these walls. Oh, you can just smell the pineapples from here, they're so yum. Oh, they smell so good. Sings it really well. Mum and Dad bought a couple from them, so I'm gonna head up back to the apartment and get some because they literally I can smell them. It's mm. making me want some pineapples so bad. I know, I feel like everybody here drives a really nice car. I've seen about like 10,000 Ferraris since being here. Like, they are so nice. So we're just heading back to the apartment to get some pineapple. <laughs> oh, by the way, if you guys are wondering where these sunnies are from. So, oh, I'm too dark now, lol. So we, these are from the vegan markets in Sydney, but they actually have an online website. These are 100% um, made from recycled corks, bottles, plastics, like a lot of different, um, even tires and stuff they uh, recycle from. So it's all recycled material. They're also polarized. Oh, they're made from PET plastic bottles as well. So I'll leave the link down below for you guys to check them out if you want proper polarized sunnies made from recycled materials. She wants me to add in that they're post-consumer plastic bottles. So they've been after, like they're made from the plastics from after use. Oh, I worked up a sweat. I've got like a full chest thing going. So this is the haul that uh, we got from the market. So they bought some pineapples. And this is actually like a gut mix. We got this last time we came to the coast. It's like um, made of all these things that are supposed to help your gut flora and stuff. Yeah, IBS. IBS, thank you. It's good for IBS. It's, it helps. it's got fiber and yeah, all that good stuff, prebiotics. So the reason why it helps with your gut is because it's got prebiotics, which feeds your probiotics, which is the gut and the bacteria the in your gut. Here's her donut. Oh my god, it looks like an actual like, And it's like crispy it's and it's soft on the inside, yeah. It's just chocolate sprinkle on it. Like a chocolate sprinkle on the top. Because all the other ones I ever got, like donut wise, they're all like um like ho nuts and stuff, like things that like markets and things that are yum. Like they are good but they're not as good as the ones I just had. They were really good. Apparently this is really good for um mouth ulcers. I get them like you wouldn't believe. I've got like three at the moment but I get them like every week I don't know why I think it's I'm low vitamin A that's what my naturopath thinks so we're trying to boost up my vitamin A at the moment but apparently roast balm oil or just rose oil in general is supposed to help um, with like mouth ulcers so I'll keep you updated on that so it's good for any fungal infection as well as like um, mouth ulcers so quick update about that rose oil it feels really nice on my lips because I got burnt just here um, so you can apply it to your lips like I said and I've applied it to the mouth ulcers in my mouth 
I know it's only been like two minutes, but it feels really good. Oh, it just smells so good. Mm. So I'm just going to chill out, eat my pineapple and things. Um, just during midday because it's like too hot to be outside. Like I'll 100% burn. So we'll go to the beach and probably the pool this afternoon as well. So I may take you along with me if you're good. So this is the like surrounding sunset. Oh, isn't that such a beautiful sunset? I love the pinks crossing in with the yellows into the blue. Oh my god, my heart's so gorgeous. So this wraps up today's vlog, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. I had such a great day. I swear those donuts, like I should have got two. I should have got two because like I could go for another one right now. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did like it, make sure to leave a big thumbs up before you leave. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any of my upcoming vlogs, videos, tutorials, all that kind of stuff. Otherwise, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you very, very soon. Bye. I thought before was pretty. Holy crap, now is beautiful.